Wendy. I want to use this opportunity to thank you. I'm so blessed to have met you. Honestly. You, Brian. I'm so happy I met you guys. And I want to use this opportunity to thank you for letting me stay with you guys. Don't you take that with you. Cocaine, Lenny. Take a lesson. Jollof rice lesson. Oh my God. This will be the best memory of my life. I promise you, Wendy. And I wish you good luck at your new place. Stay blessed. I love you. And I always love you. You have a special place in my heart. Thank you so much. Love you. Hello, Wendy and Brian. I want to use this opportunity to say a very big thank you to you guys for the love and support throughout these years. Uh, the summer is almost over and we're about to say our goodbyes. But this goodbye is probably going to mean that we are not going to see you guys in this house where we've made a lot of memories together. Um, as you embark on your new journey and go into your new house, I wish you guys nothing but the best in your marriage. I hope that God continues to shower his blessings upon you guys for the things you have done for athletes and then people across the world for the past years. I also want to use this opportunity to thank you for the love and support you've shown us throughout this summer. You've been with us and taking care of us just like your own and I truly personally do appreciate you guys and wish you all the best. Hi doggies. I do know you guys are moving from this house as I am currently. And before I go further, Wendy was in the living room so I had to sneak my way out to come sit here and make this video. But I just want you two to know that you're my favorite host parents and then you made your home feel like a blessed holy place to be and i could never take that for granted so far i'm very grateful to you wendy and brian i can't forget the fact that brian i do love you so much for being the sweetest dad but please do not mess with my tutu and wendy you'll always be the favorite of all like i don't know where to start i don't want to be a storyteller but i just want you two to know that you're very awesome and no one should take you two for granted and you deserve everything that God has for you and I truly cannot wait to see what God has for you too and I can't wait for you to unfold them all I love you so much I love you too doggies go do great hello Wendy and Brian I want to thank you all for whatever things you did for me and my friends I really appreciate you all I'm using this opportunity to say a big thank you and appreciation to you Wendy and Brian I really appreciate can't wait to see you all next year in summer and then we'll go and get hot dogs before game so i can score goals you know <laughs> hello wendy hello brian um i'd like to say a very big thank you to you both for everything you've done for me and my sisters and Personally, you've done a lot for me that I can say, but then you and I know, and I really appreciate everything you've done for me, and I'm, I'm going to remember this the rest of my life. You've made an impact in me, and it's going to be part of me, and I pray the Almighty Allah keep you safe, your family, bless you in everything you're doing, work-wise, everything your family is into. I pray and I wish you all the best. And I hope to see you the next summer. And I'm really glad I got a mom here. And I love you so much. And I hope you don't forget me. Bye. Big gas to you. I appreciate everything you do for me. Do for me. The Amaya Mami no so many. Thank you very much. Miss Wendy and Brian. Hi guys, this is JV, otherwise called Chin Punani. I just want to let the Luke family know how much I appreciate them and um, you guys have impacted me so much throughout my um, journey here in America. And um, you guys, I met you guys at a critical, very critical stage of my life and um, I am forever grateful for what you have done for me and what you continue to do. And um, I just want to say thank you guys for everything and um, 
there's never a moment where I speak about you guys and I, uh, <laughs> I don't get emotional, you know, and um, I just want to let you guys know I love you and um, all the best on your new journey, moving and selling our house. And um, I'm pretty sure that uh, Maddie and Andre and the grandkids and their husband and their wife will really appreciate you guys being closer to them and um, all the best. Hi, nice to meet you. My name is Siho Jung and Korean. Uh, first of all, I want to say I love Wendy's family because they are so warm, they are kind, funny, and so on. I did, I've never met kind of people in my life. I know mm, I'm blessed to meet them. Mm, I love uh, Wendy's family because it was really, um, I, I, I can't find the, the taste here, like in Korea, in Canada, wherever. So I want to eat food again. Um, secondly, I could enjoy playing soccer with Wendy's team at Kansas City Pro Team. I really appreciate uh, to Wendy always about that because I, I couldn't um, have that experience if Wendy didn't send email to them. So I had passed and I passed. Okay, thank you, Wendy. Um, I learned lots of things um, like uh, American mind, open mind, um, culture. Um, I've never um, thought and why they are, um, they are like that. Um, I mean, like people like we talk to each other, um, so nice and funny. Um, at the time, I didn't speak uh, English, so I couldn't explain what I wanted say. However, they understood and catch it what I wanted and needed. Um, uh, I really, really love them. I don't know, I love the, the, the family I want to meet again. Happy, happy family. Uh, I, I, will, I will make a plan to visit you. So if I go there, I will contact you. So don't ignore, okay? Okay, guys, I love you still. I remember I, I didn't forget what you did to me. So I, 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 I'm trying to be like you guys to the others, like good influence, good people, like good person, good thinking um, of everything, trying. Okay, I love you. Thank you, bye-bye. Hi, Wendy, how are Hola, from Colombia. Hi, from Colombia. Hi, Colombia. And we just heard that you're going to sell your house. And we are so sad to hear that you're going to be selling it. But we're also very happy for your new journey and your life. We had so many great memories in that house. Um, I can't even count with my fingers all the memories. But let me think on the top of my head of some memories that I've had in that house. Um... That was how many years ago? Almost 18 years ago it's been since I lived in that basement. And so I remember when I tore my ACL. I remember you guys taking care of me very well. I remember Brian. He was just always treating me like I was his daughter. And yeah, Wendy just took care of me. I remember Wendy shaving my legs in her bathtub. Um, I remember crying my eyes out in well, Maddie's room because I broke up with my boyfriend, Zach. Um, <laughs> I remember lots of soccer parties. That was probably my favorite memory 
most of all is just that house was just a great house of creating community for people. I just always felt love there, always supported there. Um, just thank you guys so much for everything you've done for me. I started my journey there, um, and maybe I've ended my journey here in Columbia with my crazy kids. I remember when I first came to your house, my kids were the same age as Maddie and, and Andre. And so it's just crazy to see that Maddie and Andre has grown up and now that I have little tiny crazy kids. So yeah, we love you and pray for you guys that your next journey in your life, the Lord leads you and guides you and, and continues to bless you um, even though you're not going to be living in that house I'm sure you're going to continue to just be a blessing to those around you we love you so much bye ciao Wendy and Brian I just wanted to say thank you so much for letting me live here it has been the biggest blessing of my life um, being here I've learned so much and I was able to accomplish a lot of my goals um, you guys helped me, you know, get into my dream school and help me become a better soccer player. But not only that, you guys have helped me be able to help others. And that's what I really appreciate. I've grown so much more values here. Um, I've seen such a great relationship between all the ups and downs. And I felt like I was really a part of a, this family. And I really appreciate you guys being so welcoming and so helpful. You know, like when my car broke, when I got into a car accident, you guys let me use the car and just stuff like that. You guys have helped so much in my life and I really appreciate all you have done for me and everyone else around me as well. You guys are real great role models and I want to do exactly what you guys do in the future. Like. I want to be able to help others just as much as you guys did and it really just stems from just living with you guys and seeing you guys do it and I just appreciate all you have done for me and all you've done for everybody everybody in the past and everybody currently you guys help out so much and are such a blessing and I, may God bless you guys as you go into your new journey and your new house and with your grandkids and the pool of Miss Millie and Sylvie. And it's just going to be so great. And I want to see you guys all the time when I come back and when you guys come up or I guess it's down to Louisiana. I'm just so excited to be a part of you guys' family and just felt so welcoming and I've gained so much. Just thank you so much for all you've done, Wendy and Brian, for me. And I appreciate it. Thank you for making me feel like a child of your own. <laughs>